custom question builder, short answer settings, editing tolerance, and more. In step one of your short answer, you choose the answer rule. Here you can choose if you will accept unsimplified answers, exact answers, a subset of answers, you can clarify if the answer is text, or contains a symbol, etc. In step two, you clarify your answer values. Note that you can enter multiple answers or require ordered pairs. You can require all the solutions listed to be entered. You can override the default number of attempts for a question. You can right-click in the value box to access editing options. You can embed algorithmic values, symbols, constants, functions, and more. In step three, you work with answer formatting options. This includes setting comma options, choosing text matching if applicable, modifying tolerance, and more. These options can vary based on the type of variable you've chosen. In step four, you can edit feedback and view default messaging. If you right click, you can easily enter algorithmic values or formulas in your student messaging. Always preview your question to see the student view. Click on the tutorial links under help for training guides and videos about the custom question builder tool. Thank you for watching our video. Learn more about this and other features on our product training and support site.